Hey, everybody. Welcome back to A Late Show. My next guest tonight is an Emmy award-winning actor you know from Watchmen, Aquaman, and The Get Down. His latest movie is The Trial of the Chicago 7. You can give this speech in Chicago. Fred Hampton wants me there. Plane ticket? Let Fred give the speech. Between Hayden and Hoffman, there could be 5,000 people. It'd be nice to talk to 5,000 people. Not while you're in trouble in Connecticut. Yes, while I'm in trouble. I'm the head of the Black Panther. So when the hell am I not going to be in trouble? Travel bag. You're going to be in a lot more of it if you stand up and say, fry the pigs. If they attack you, you take them out of context. So will every white person in America. Cops won't give a about context, and you don't have enough protection in Chicago. There's no place to be right now, but in it. But fry the pigs? If they Dr. attack... Dr. King! He's dead. He has a dream. Well, now he has a bullet in his head. Martin's dead, Malcolm's dead, Megha's dead, Bobby's dead, Jesus is dead. They tried it peacefully. We gonna try something else. Please welcome to A Late Show, Yahya Abdul-Mateen II. Hey, thanks so Thank much you. for being here. Thank you for having me, man. How you doing? Uh, I'm doing well. It's a as I, as I was saying before we came on camera. It's a great performance as Bobby Seale. I, thank you. Thank I, you. I, I want to get to that, but first I just want to make sure. Did I get your name right? Because I know a lot of people have mispronounced your first name. Am I in the ballpark? And and if not, Late night TV, educate man. me. I, I'll give you a ten out of ten. I'll give you a straight up ten Boom! out of ten. I don't think I've heard. I don't think I've heard my name that way on television just yet. But can I say something? Oh, sure. So. You're the guest. You can say anything so, you want. I like what you've said so far. So most people, most people uh, in my life, they call me Yaya. You know, a few, a few people, a few good friends. I don't think any family call me calls me Yaya, but most people call me Yaya. So I don't mind if someone says Yaya. It, it's always, it's always cool if someone can and does go out of their way to say Yaya, and I always appreciate that. What I would just really irks my nerve, I just have to put it that way, is when someone says, yeah, yeah, you know, when they make the H just too big, I mean, when they make the A just too big on my name, and that's when, that's when I need the H, that's when I just kind of shut down the production, and I need to, <laughs> I need the H on my name, you well, know, so. Well, I'm glad we don't have to shut down production, that would be a difficult, we have a show to do here. No, nah, no, nah, So let's, nah, let's keep nah, rolling nah. with production here. Uh, congratulations are in order, you just won your first Emmy for Watchmen, um, yeah, that's man. a great Thank feeling. You. Is that is that also your Thank first you. nomination? Uh, yes, yes, my first first nomination. First, Bat in a first thousand. Win. Got it. Bat in a thousand. Yeah, got an that's Emmy. Not too Didn't shabby. Didn't come with an Emmy, but that's all right. <laughs> <laughs> well, what did that what did that feel like to uh, win over Zoom? It was cool, man. It was it was crazy. I, I'll tell you something about Zoom. Every time I open up a Zoom, I feel like I'm a, I feel like I'm getting ready to read a manifesto. Man, it's just. Is this, this this whole Zoom world is just is just really really bizarre? But um, it was fun, man. I'm there, you know. I'm reading. I'm, I mean, I'm I'm doing the Emmy thing. I'm dressed up in my suit. I got my cousin. I got my family there, and I finally, you know, they make the announcement. I win, and um, I think I we actually off. I was super. We have a clip of it right here. Can we? Let, oh, we oh, let's okay. show the clip, Jim. Let's show the clip of uh, of Yahya winning. Uh, the people who believed in me first, I call you my my uh, my early investors. I love you. I appreciate you, and this one is for you. Thank you. <laughs> What's that? What's happening at the end there? I was trying to keep my cool, man. I was trying to keep my cool, and obviously, I thought I thought the camera wasn't on me no more. So you know, I keep my cool, my composure, sure. and I you know I give my nice speech and my thanks and my toast, and I sit the glass down. And for some reason, I thought, well, once I sit the glass down, the camera's not on me anymore, you know, so I get to <laughs> run off. But uh, but that was really my true excitement up under all of that. And, you know, after that, uh, it was nice because I had another camera going, another, you know, computer going with my Zoom. And I had a party, We, you know, myself and my family, about 15 members of my family over Zoom. We had a party uh, drinking champagne and dancing and really celebrating. It, that was about 3, from 3.30 uh, in the morning over here until about 7 a.m. And then uh, got up, went to work, and you know, it was just a regular day after that. But but yeah, that was that that was pretty special. Now I hear you, that you got into acting in kind of an unusual way. That you actually studied architecture. Yeah 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 yeah. And I then architecture. worked as a city planner. I worked in city planner. Now yeah, those in San those Francisco. are those are two very well respected jobs. Why did you yeah, want to go yeah. off and join the circus and be in show business? How'd that come about? <laughs> Uh, I, I got laid off, man. I got laid off from my job, and I said, you know what? I, I just I, I, I want to go and have some fun. You know, I was in college, 
and uh, I ran track in college and uh, a teammate of mine, you know, after I had done some skits and things like that, making fun of the, uh, the coaches and things, a teammate of mine recommended that I take a theater class. He said, bro, you should take a theater class. It's just like recess. <laughs> so, I was, you know, I said, OK, well, you know, everybody in college, you know, everybody always look for the easy A. So that was my easy A for the semester. I auditioned with a monologue from a from a baby boy, doing my best John, doing my best uh, Ving Rams impersonation, and uh, I get in the class and I, you know I had fun. So that 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 was the seed for me. Well, uh, we got some uh -oh. photos of you in high school actually here. Okay. Um, tell me what's now. This is you at the computer terminals. Was it? <laughs> were, were, were you in, were you into programming? Did you did you run with a nerd crowd? <laughs> I was definitely, uh, I, I don't know if I was a nerd crowd, but I was, a, you know, well, maybe I was just by telling this story. I'm kind of out of myself. <laughs> I was, um, so every Thursday, my, my, my senior year, it was me and my two best friends. Uh, we, we wore turtlenecks on Thursday. That was like turtleneck Thursday. So that's, that was, a, that's a very, uh, nerd, nerd thing to do. But yeah, <laughs> I was bit. that dude, man. I was, yeah, yeah, just a little bit. So, but I also played chess. You know, I was in the debate club, but oh, wow. I also was on, you know, did varsity basketball, and you know, I, I uh, lettered in track for three years. And, so, were you, you in know, the I, I was, National Forensic League? Were you, were you, did you go to tournaments? Did you do the National Forensic League? Was it Lincoln Douglas four man debate? What were you guys doing? I don't, I don't know. I just remember being, being, be going up to UC Berkeley with my, with the rest of my classmates, debating, and, and you know, we didn't know no rules or nothing like that. We just went up there, and, you know. Did debates. Well, are, now your friends, with well, the guys with the turtlenecks, is it this crowd too? Are, are these yes, the same yes. guys? See, that's duality. That's um, you know duality. Duality because you got to be well rounded. You got you got turtleneck and, and like sweater yaya, but then you got the <laughs> dreadlock yaya who can you know who can really give it to you too. So uh, yeah, that was the prom. I won prom king, by the way. You won prom king. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You weren't so, a nerd you know, then. Was... I'm sorry, you just lost your nerd cred. <laughs> I have to take your card away. You can reapply. Oh, man, you can reapply that. later. But for now, I'm afraid we have to we have to impound your card because you won uh, prom king. All right, all right. Folks, we gotta take a little bit of a break, but stick around when we come back. I will ask Yahya about playing Bobby Seal in the new movie, The Trial of the Chicago Seven. Stick around. So